So today question is which programming language should I learn? Basically this question was asked by a guy. I didn't remember his name in the comment in my one of my video which I include the link basically computer science versus information technology. Basically this is a question which is very interesting. Which programming language should I learn? Basically of course if you want to become a web programmer or web developer you should always learn HTML and CSS and then I know this is not a programming language but 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 according to my opinion CSS3 is had become a programming language which is a lot of I mean guru out there will strongly disagree with me but let's get to the question which programming language should I learn should I start with C should I start with C++ C sharp Java Python Ruby Ruby JavaScript which programming language should I learn basically I will just say start with JavaScript Java if you learn JavaScript learning any another programming language will be easy for you or start with C basically most of this language like javascript python php is called the c programming language which is the father of all of the programming language i mean just start with learning with javascript if you learn javascript learning php will be easy if you learn php first learning javascript will be hard because you will screw indeed yes javascript is one of the weird language uh, indeed yet there's a lot of courses online you can buy for a subscription fees i mean uh, uh, JavaScript for PHP developer. If you learn PHP first, you learn JavaScript, it's really hard. I'm not saying it's hard, but it will make all your concept mess up. Basically, in PHP, you have to declare a variable like it's integer, integer mean one, or it's a float mean 1.0, or it is a boolean. But in JavaScript, it does not exist. I mean you will start doing some kind of weird stuff which you shouldn't do basically how to get started learning java just I mean pick some kind of stupid this kind of basically head first book this, this is one of the stupid book you can get in a programming language but remember one thing you should be stupid guy and then you should use the stupid material to learn because if you take programming seriously it will start producing heat I mean overwhelming will make you learn nothing it will i mean make the learning process worse basically i just love this i mean basically basically this i mean javascript basically you can see it's really i mean who the hell will i mean imagine there will, will be a retro basically vintage i mean lady in a programming book basically you should always always learn programming language from an unserious book you you should definitely learn from a real serious manual but when you become a i mean a good basic to advanced level programmer and then just move on to a serious book which will focus on the high level stuff but never ever start with i mean with some kind of serious book you can see here basically this thing that do you think that's interesting indeed it is if there was a real i mean big lines of chunk of code in it you will feel not interesting basically basically this book is i mean really awesome this book that said i mean talk loud listen to your brain feel something drink water get sleep these old things are basic things but these things are really awesome let me show you basically here is a javascript history javascript 1 basically javascript 1.3 are you getting interested in learning program? Indeed, yes. If you just pick any another, I mean, I'm not, I'm not against any book. Like you pick PHP, I, I'm, what is the book called? Sam for Java, I mean the Sam book for JavaScript, JavaScript, uh, learn JavaScript in 24 hours, something like that, or all in one JavaScript jQuery book. Basically, it will make you hard. Basically, learning a like this one, or better ship. Basically, for head first, this is your brain your brain is something interesting basically the human always learn things which are interesting or or the otherwise like a plain boring text who i will feel sleep basically basically or you can go to lynda.com or i mean i have even taken a lynda.com javascript course back in the days and then i won this year not this year at the last year in december i have taken the and three uh, team of javascript course which is really good i think the uh, team three hours cost 25 bucks per month unlimited course and then even linda cost 25 bucks a month basically there's are three way you can learn you can learn for free 
just I mean googling it basically or you can pay like watching some kind of video or third you can buy a book basically this book cost me 32 bucks basically you can buy from amazon.com or from the book this post study if you're international I mean guy I mean you are international people I mean you're living overseas which I mean to say you are living overseas even if you are not located in United States basically you should buy this book from book dispository rather than buying from the Amazon why because Amazon will be expensive to you because due to shipping charges and book dispository offer 100 country free shipping I mean basically this book only cost you 50 bucks if you are buying the brick and mortar store just buy this book and start learning my basically my answer to the question is that start with javascript and then move to php and then higher level language basically even i should i would say not start with c a lot of people think they're starting with c because c is the father of all language it is the foundation no basically javascript is an interpreter language which means you really do not need to compile basically you just need two things a web browser and a basic notepad basically just write a code and then run it that's all you need and then one thing if you are going to learn javascript you should have some basic understanding of html or css basically if you are learning javascript basically learning javascript you should definitely have some kind of basic html or css i mean knowledge under your belt i mean just basic like basic the basic you can learn within one hour nothing special that is answer to question just start with javascript buy a head first book or any another book which make you interesting i mean just buy it just start with javascript if you start with php first awesome but it will make your concept a little bit confusing my answer is that Start with JavaScript, that's all.